Dr. Albert Shababo, hello, good morning. Good morning. So, Dr. Shababo, what do we know so far about this new Brazilian variant of COVID-19? And what we know is that it's a variant that was found first in Japan from four people that traveled to Manaus, Amazonia. Uh, this variant has the same mutations of the variants from UK and the variant from South Africa. But uh, it has another mutation, so it's a new variant, maybe a Brazilian variant, with those mutations from UK, from South Africa, and a, a lot of, of new mutations uh, not described yet. And what does this change mean? Uh, maybe we have to prove it, but maybe uh, with the, the, those mutations from, uh, like those, those from UK, uh, this uh, signifies that it has uh, a power to, to be more transmissible like the mm -hmm. variant from UK and like the mm -hmm. variant from South Africa. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, it's a new variant, so we have to study the other's mutation to, to know if they have some impact on violence, of the, the, the power to, to have more severe disease. This we don't mm -hmm. know yet. So at the moment, we're not sure if this variant can cause more serious illness. No, no, we don't, we don't know this. Uh, studies are, are being done to, to evaluate those, those, uh, mm -hmm. those new variants. But what we know is that in Manaus now, we have a lot of people, uh, a huge outbreak, a lot of people uh, in severe conditions, maybe because we have too much cases. And so mm -hmm. when we have too much cases, we will see more severe patients, more critical patients. Hospitals uh, in Manaus have reached breaking point following the new outbreak. How severe is the situation there? Yes, it's a mix of the new variant and, uh, and people that didn't uh, do digital, uh, di uh, social distance, uh, use, uh, mask uses, because people understood that they have reached uh, immune, uh, herd immunity, so they relax with those uh, with those uh, using of masks mm -hmm. and social distancing. So we have a mix of, of causes, uh, yeah. the new variants and the abandon of the, the, the social distancing in the use of masks. How concerned are you in light of this? Yes, we are worried because uh, patients from Manaus are being transferred to another states because of the collapse in the uh, health system in Manaus. So we are exporting uh, from Manaus patients with those new variants uh, to another states. So it's, it's possible that we can introduce those variants uh, in some states and things happen in those states like uh, Manaus, uh, with a huge increase in, in the number of cases. Do you see, Dr. Shababo, reinfections also? Yes, we have some uh, studies that shows that uh, the immune systems uh, system can, can uh, th those virus can evade from the immune system uh, from people that already uh, had uh, COVID-19. So uh, uh, reinfections is uh, one of the problems, one of the causes uh, of this uh, increasing the number of cases in Manaus because of this new variant. Are you worried the vaccines won't be effective against the new variant? It's a, it's a concern, yes, but uh, until now we don't have uh, any studies showing that the vaccine will not uh, mm -hmm. function or will not respond to this new, new variant. There is a study with the uh, UK variant uh, from mm -hmm. Pfizer uh, showing that uh, it's not it, it, uh, this variant not affect the uh, the people who are uh, vaccinated with Pfizer mm -hmm. vaccine. We need uh, studies with other vaccines, with, with CoronaVac, mm -hmm. with Oxford, to understand if those uh, variants can affect people uh, vaccinated. But it's a concern. We know UK and other countries ban flights from Brazil. Is it justified in your opinion? Yeah, I don't think that uh, uh, 
uh, all Brazil uh, must they 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 should uh, block all Brazil because uh, now we we know that the problem is is located in Manaus, uh, so it would be better to to block people from from Amazonas or from Manaus or from the north region uh, because. Uh, when you block people from from travel from one one place to another, it's an, a lot of difficulties mm -hmm. in commerce and study and a lot of a lot of, of problems caused by this regulation. Can you claim the variant is under the, under control in Brazil? I don't think so. In in Manaus, Manaus, it's 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 a, a problem. But until now, we, we don't see uh, any impact of, the, of this new variant on other cities or mm -hmm. uh, other states. Uh, but we in Brazil, we have uh, a few lab, labs that can sequence, sequence the virus. So it's probable, probable that uh, we have uh, uh, those variants uh, in other places in Brazil that we don't know because we, we didn't sequence a lot of virus to understand how uh, it's moving in the Brazilian territory. Dr. Albert Shebabo, thank you very much for this interview. Thank you very much.